Toronto's Black Arts and Innovation Expo celebrates Black History Month by highlighting the achievements of forward-thinking creators. Francis Jeffers will be taking part. He is the curator of the International African Inventors Museum, and he's here to share some of the inventions created by Africans that we use and, and enjoy every day. And can we start with the potato chip? Oh, it's wonderful. I mean, this is one of the most popular items uh, for people. Um, George Crumb. Interesting name. Yes. How apropos, <laughs> right, for a potato, for potato a, chip. A, a biracial um, African American and, and Native American who, who came up with the, by accident, came up with the potato chip. And that has been a favorite since he started in Lake Saratoga in the United States. Accident. You know what? Yeah. Great things come out of accidents. Yes, we yes. hear this all the time a with absolutely. inventions. Absolutely. I mean, that, that's where the creative juices flow. Love it. And then we have Lonnie Johnson, who is a nuclear engineer. Tell us about Lonnie. But, but Lonnie like kids and like having, making fun instruments and came up with the, the Super Soaker, which is the most popular water gun in history. Yeah, my kids have two of those. Absolutely. So, La yeah. Last year, he had a check for $72 million. My gosh. Just some royalties. Some, on the Super Soaker. On, on the Super Soaker. My then gosh. Then there's the infamous or famous um, Jack Johnson, one of the most controversial black boxers of its time, the first black heavyweight champion, but who was also an inventor. It says that regardless of your background, if you have a creativity, you can do something. So he had three inventions. Even when they were chasing him across state lines for interracial marriage, he was still using his head and still coming up with inventions. There's an interesting story about people is how nothing stops them. Then you have Garrett Morgan, who is one of the most famous black inventors of all times, who invented the gas mask, uh, which saved numerous lives in, in, in the World War I. And the traffic signal. And, and the traffic signal, which has become a worldwide phenomenon. That every, every country has a traffic signal. Of course, but the and brilliance this, behind that. Right, and he's one, he's one of the 27 black inventors in the National Hall of Fame of Inventors in the United States. Yeah, and so he should be. And then the peanut butter guy, Mr. George Washington Carver, who went ballistic with the, with the peanuts and soybean and just created, you know, the peanut butter, peanut oil, and just maybe like something like 200 inventions and patterns all about the peanuts and soybeans. And as you, know? you say, it's curiosity, right? It's, uh, that, it's that insatiable yeah. sense of curiosity where just one step further, I can get yeah, this yeah, right, I'm right. onto something, Abs but I'm gonna stick with it. Yeah, absolutely, the this, this spirit. And um, then we have something much more serious, cortisone. I think anybody who's received any kind of pains in their cartilage or whatever, have to thank um, Mr. P Dr. Percy Julian for his work in development and of preparation of cortisone, which for, for most people who have arthritis and rheumatism is a, a life saving in terms, of, in terms of their ability to walk and maneuver. So, I mean, what we're looking at is the creative juices of people that even when we go back from the 1800s to present day, people are still performing and still creating. And you've been able to take this exhibit to schools uh, right across this country, right uh, all over the place. Yes, we've been um, all around Central, um, Central Canada, sharing with young people, motivating young people, that they too they can have their own legacy. So these people they were not special people. They were people who made that step forward, used their creativity, used, saw, um, saw, got ideas, and produce things. And didn't give up. And they didn't give up. And that's why we try to encourage young people to do. Francis, thank, thank you, you so much. You're this is most thank interesting. You really nice to Thanks meet you. Lot. We will have links to the Black Arts and Innovation Expo and the International African Inventors Museum on our website, canadaam.ctvnews.ca. We're back after this.